Thanks for watching WCCO, also streaming on CBSN Minnesota. President Donald Trump says that the federal government will soon ship millions of COVID-19 tests to all 50 states. The rapid point of care tests were purchased from Abbott and can be performed without any lab equipment. Kay Raddatz shares what this new initiative could mean in the fight against COVID-19. Thank you very much. President Thank Trump you. announced Monday that 150 million rapid COVID-19 tests will be distributed to states, including Minnesota and Wisconsin, over the next several weeks. 50 million of the tests will go to the most vulnerable communities, and 100 million are intended to help keep K through 12 schools open. Would allow every state to on a very regular basis, test every teacher who needs it. This is not the deep brain biopsy that we talk about. The Assistant Secretary for Health and Human Services demonstrated how to use the test that gives results within 15 minutes. It's about the size of a credit card. We just started this. You remember we'd go out and we'd have to find these massive laboratories with tremendously expensive equipment. Now we're down to something that you'll see that is really from a different planet. Here in Minnesota, more than 22,000 COVID-19 tests were administered Sunday, above Governor Wall's moonshot 20,000 goal that was set back in April. We know that uh, that's not enough as um, we want to continue uh, testing, doing much more testing in our long-term care settings, doing more testing in schools. Before the president's announcement, MDH infectious disease expert Chris Ayersman said she was aware of additional testing becoming available from the federal government, but said more tests are not a simple solution to getting back to normal. A big part of what is necessary to be successful involves not only identifying cases early, but also making sure that people are following through on guidance. And we've certainly been hearing more and more that people are not doing that. Kate Raditz, WCCO 4 News. State health officials say Minnesotans will soon have additional access to testing with the opening of new saliva testing locations. They say that the state should then have the capacity to do 40 to 50,000 tests a day.